a wondrous age. March, the one-time little wayside station in Cambridgeshire, has become a huge railway sorting and distributing centre, where thousands of wagons of minerals and merchandise are reshuffled into new trains. This is just a small section of the newest railway robot, which, with its electrically controlled siding, stands, covers over 100 acres. Scientific research and inventive genius have here combined to provide the means to sort a 60 wagon train into 40 sidings in six minutes. Into this control tower, day and night, are shot instructions for the breaking up and making up of new trains. One man at the switch table sets up a number of point movements which are automatically operated by the wagons themselves as they pass clear of the points. A novel form of brake called a retarder is worked from the tower. It grips the wagon wheels and graduates the speed so that each wagon rolls with uncanny precision into its proper siding. To walk up and down these long sidings would make a pretty tiring day, for it would mean a stroll of 30 miles. Look at these wagons wandering, as it were, aimlessly over points and crossings, yet each one definitely controlled by the invisible men in the town. This you might describe as a worm's eye view of the retarder in action. And so, power and progress in transportation is day and night keeping the wheels of industry turning and ever more quickly.